Hi everyone, I'm Heather Wen, a retired nurse practitioner and the founder and practitioner at Arizona Healing Alternatives. On this channel, you'll find several videos. Some will be shorter and some will be longer, what I like to call aha moments, where we're gonna be discussing issues that impact your health. So whether you decide to use Western medicine, alternative medicine, or even a mix of both, I'm passionate about you knowing what your options are. For today's video, I'm going to take a little excerpt out of one of the videos that I've done, which is practical stress reduction during COVID times, because so many people have asked for this little technique that can help uh, de-stress and catch up on sleep that I wanted to show you, and it's called Category 4 Blocking. So stay tuned. us to focus on is I'm going to put up this picture and this slide I want you to see there's also something very easy you can do at home from the world of chiropractic care there's this thing called category 4 blocking and this came straight from the total body modification or TBM website and what you can do is you notice those pelvic bones so if you see that picture that's the backside of somebody if you see that picture you're noticing that those pelvic bones are even okay well so on most people, the pelvic bones are different. Take a look at mine right now, right? I've been working for a bit this morning. So that being the case, since I'm doing something active, you'll notice that this side is higher and closer to my head than this side, which is closer to my feet. When you have that, adrenaline is being secreted. I'm making a video, I'm working. So of course adrenaline is secreted, that's normal. But what we wanna be able to do is to calm that down. You can do this with a pair of shoes at home, so easy to do. I know it says on the picture that you know it's done at 5.30 or 6 o'clock at night, but you can do it any time. Best thing to do is to lay down flat and have somebody look at you from above and see which is higher. I mean, right now I'm standing up, you can see it, so sometimes in the mirror you can see it. But if you lay on the floor, which is where you need to be on a hard surface to do this anyway, and you try to lift your head up, what can sometimes happen is you can't see it very well so if there's someone else around the house great if not you can look in the mirror so for me this one's higher well what does that even mean if that one's higher it means that if there's this imbalance in these theories that the thing that sits above those pelvic bones are our kidneys and above that are our adrenal glands so if there's too much pressure in one area and not enough pressure in another it stimulates those adrenal glands to keep kicking out that adrenaline so if we even it out like it shows in the picture then it turns off that system and helps the body calm down and de-stress. So what we would do very easily at home, you'd see which side, and then I'm gonna use, this is what I use in the office, but like I said, a pair of shoes turned upside down can do the same thing. What you'll do, since that bone is here, is on the back side, that's why the picture showed the back side. On the back side, you push this down like this, you just put it underneath you at a diagonal, and then the other side, like it shows in the picture, will go where we consider the sit bone, right underneath where the rear end is. And what you're gonna do is point that the opposite direction. So it's gonna look like this one's pushing down, this one is pushing up, it makes this nice diagonal, one way or the other, depending on which way that, is, uh, that hip is pointing. So when you have that, then you just lay on it. This one's down like this, this one's like this underneath me, and you're just gonna lay on it. And when you lay on it, when you're done, what will happen is those bones will even out and someone can check you. And that is a fast and easy way for a lot of my patients who end up with insomnia and other problems. I teach them how to do this at home. If you're up anyway, you might as well do that to turn off that fight or flight because once the fight or flight gets going, you can't sleep. It's the fastest way to take a power nap and it's an amazing technique to do. So I recommend you guys play with that and try that. I hope this information has been helpful to you today. If you like what you've seen, please feel free to hit that subscribe button. You can also hit that notification bell and anytime new videos come out, you'll be notified. Not only that, but please feel free to leave any comments, any questions that you have, I'll be happy to answer that. So please try out these techniques, see what works, see what doesn't. And please, I know everyone says stay safe, but it's really true. Stay safe, stay healthy, de-stress, have a good day.